Hi guys, I'm back with another video today. So, I haven't done a gaming review in a very long time. But I thought to myself, maybe I should do a very special gaming review today. Now, most recently, my very first video, Tips of NASCAR at the Daytona 500, has actually been doing pretty well. There's a lot of comments and a lot of people have watched that video. A lot of people have been talking about recently. So I would like to do another Tips of NASCAR. So the last time I did a Tips of NASCAR race was at Las Vegas. And that was downstairs on this TV. Now, this TV is now in my room, so now I can finally do it. Um, so, we're gonna, today, today's video is going to be Tips of NASCAR at Phoenix. Huh, who do I want to do today? Hmm. Let me see, who do I want to do? I'll do Matt, Matt, Matt Kenseth today. Okay, uh, okay. Phoenix, Phoenix, where's Phoenix? Phoenix, 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 okay. Excuse me, I burped. Man, this loading screen is going very slow. Okay. Um, let me go normal settings um okay so you know i'm qualifying right now let's see where i can qualify um you know this is not my uh this is definitely not my favorite track to be at this is not my favorite track to be at but i'll definitely try my best At Phoenix, you want to slow up in the corners so you don't hit the wall. If you don't slow up in the corners at this track, you're going to hit the wall. I know that for experience. Huh, I qualified pretty well. That's probably one... That's probably one of the fastest times I've ever got here. That's, uh, that's surprising. That's pretty quick. Well, I qualified on the pole.
hmm, usually I would never pull away at this race, but somehow it's happening today. It must be that I'm having really good luck at this track today, because usually I never pull away from, um, I usually never pull away from Martin Truex Jr. But so far I'm having a pretty good day, pretty fast car, I'm pretty happy. Um, well, Matt, Matt, Matt Kenseth does really well at this track, so typically he has a really good car here, so that's probably why I'm doing better. Uh, there's all, there's only one tip that I can really give at Phoenix is, uh, get off the acceleration in the corners at this track, because if you don't get off the acceleration quick enough in the corners at this track, uh, you will hit the wall, um, this is not my first time doing a tips of NASCAR uh, on NASCAR Heat 5. I did one like about nine, nine, nine months ago. That would have been like around December. This is only a six lap race and we're coming to the last lap. And it looks like I might even be able to lap down some people because I have a really good car. I'm going to pass Queen Hoff and pass Hill. Maybe I can get around Fitchum, Chad Fincham. And I do, and I'm like about six seconds ahead. I pass Newt. Overall, I had a very solid race at... Uh, Overall, I had a very solid race at Phoenix. I think this is the first time I've won Phoenix in this game. But but usually, Math Kenseth has a really good race. I'm going to do a burnout. This is my favorite part of these games, is the burnouts at the end. Overall, I had a pretty good race at Phoenix. Like I said, the only tips tips I can really give at Phoenix is try to break as best as you can when you get into the corners at Phoenix. Or right when you're getting into the corner, um, try to get the, off the acceleration the best as possible. Uh, overall, this is probably the best I've ever done in Phoenix. Um, you know, I never really played Matt Kenseth at Phoenix, but whenever I go to Phoenix, uh, Matt Kenseth is always in the top five. And I usually do pretty good at Phoenix, but this is the first time I've ever won at Phoenix in this game. But overall, that is tips of NASCAR at Phoenix Raceway. And if you guys like this video, please like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace, period.